Um, yeah, it's a great privilege to be on the committee and uh, assist in putting the awards together for uh, 2015. We've got some great wines to judge, obviously, out of the recent vintages, so it's, it's going to be a blast. We're putting together a great panel to, to judge this, and uh, yeah, I feel mighty privileged to be able to assist in that process. Judging the 2015 awards will, um, will be a real pleasure. It'll be, uh, I don't think Hawke's Bay will have lined up uh, three great, as good of vintages as we're going to see uh, this year. Um, and so I think you know exhibitors and judges and consumers alike should be really excited about about the the, um, uh, the quality of what's going to come out of Hawke's Bay. And I, I, I fully expect that we'll see a high proportion of gold medals and, and awards um, because you know the, the, uh, what Hawke's Bay's done over the last few years in terms of improving the improving wine quality across the board. Um, uh, you know we've got every reason to think um, that uh, we'll, we'll get a really strong showing this year. These wine awards are going to be, as, uh, as the three vintages that uh, move up into this 13, 14 and 15 are the, the strongest three vintages we've, uh, we've seen uh, probably uh, since my time here in, in, in Hawke's Bay and that's almost 20 years. So I think anybody that gets a chance to judge at this wine awards will see a fantastic uh, range of wines and, and I think uh, you're going to see a record number of gold medals and, and trophies.